Ventricular filling is one of the phases of the cardiac cycle and the name filling tells us that during this phase ventricles are receiving blood. The fact is, as soon as the wall of ventricles relax, the pressure inside the ventricles quickly drops. So we end up with this situation that inside atrium we have higher pressure because we know that atria constantly receive blood through the veins and compared to the pressure in the atrium, the pressure inside the ventricle is lower. So if you imagine yourself standing inside the atria, it's like you're pushing to open the AV valves. And that's exactly the explanation why both AV valves open during ventricular filling due to pressure gradient, high pressure in atrium versus low pressure in ventricle. So tricuspid valve in the right side and bicuspid valve in the left side simultaneously open and blood quickly flows from high pressure which is inside the atrium into the low pressure which would be inside the ventricle. Since ventricles are receiving blood, obviously the wall of ventricles stay relaxed during the entire time that we are in ventricular filling. But please note that the wall of atria also stay relaxed during ventricular filling. So we can say that the entire heart is relaxed during ventricular filling. And the entrance into the ventricles, which would be AV valves, are open but the exit out of the ventricles, those are semilunar valves, are closed because we know when ventricles are receiving blood, they cannot simultaneously pump blood out. So in short, during ventricular filling, ventricles receive most of the blood that they need from atria, from high to low pressure, and the entire heart stay relaxed. Atrial walls and ventricular walls are all relaxed. The entrance into the ventricles, AV valves are open, but the exit out of the ventricles, semilunar valves, are closed. The next phase, which I'm going to explain it in another video, is atrial systole. Please keep in mind, at the end of ventricular filling, the wall of atria start contracting. However, as soon as the wall of atria contract, we switch to the next phase. So I emphasize one more time that during ventricular filling, the entire heart is relaxed.